hi guys welcome back to beauty by chick welcome back to my channel so today is the day that i'm supposed to be ovulating and your girl was on a trip i was on a little mini getaway with my family we went to quebec city we're in canada so this is somewhere in canada that we wanted to go and to explore quebec city and montreal so it's kind of funny because when you're ttcing on the go and you're in a hotel confined with kids and all that stuff it can make things a little bit difficult the baby dancing part, the baby dancing part was all right. I'm going, this is a little TMI. But while I was on my trip, I did not test for ovulation. I kind of just went with the app and I'm so, I'm a little annoyed by it. But today's the day that I'm officially supposed to ovulate. So I am going to go ahead and check real quick to see what is up. And I'm going to talk to you. I'm going to go ahead and do that fast and then I'll talk to you guys. Another thing is because we are trying, we're TTCing for, you know, try in hopes for a boy, um, the the baby dancing needs to be done at specific particular times so i was kind of concerned that had i say i was early like i am now and i baby danced which i did you know i could possibly get pregnant from that as opposed to which nothing is wrong with that i don't have any issues any qualms with that but in hopes for a boy i would have kind of messed that opportunity up if you know just because i did it at uh, two days too soon or one day too soon because they say that it's okay to do it one day before ovulation and then after so um yeah that's what i would be running into i already gone ahead and baby danced yesterday but given that baby dance i've already gone ahead and baby danced yeah day early but moving forward now at least i know i didn't ovulate so now i can kind of aim towards ovulation it's like this right now so i'm assuming i am probably going to be ovulating tonight like it's gonna be darker tonight because this is early morning and i did use it with very concentrated fmu because on our travels yesterday i didn't want to have to run to the washroom a lot so i didn't drink too much and then i slept so yeah my my urine is just like way too yellow i need to go chug water which i already started doing but yeah i'm excited i'm excited about that progression i feel like you could almost oh you can pick it up on camera which is very rare you can never do that with all the others so this is what that's looking like. I am definitely getting close. It's getting brighter and that's actually really exciting. This is exciting news, guys. So I didn't miss my opportunity. I'm pretty pumped to um, baby dance this month. Keeping my fingers crossed that it is my month. And, you know, for all of you guys, sending love and blessings to all of you. And hope that it's your month too. I also got this new fact from um, on my family on my family vlog channel. Someone was indicating that the timing does matter as well. Whether you're baby dancing in the morning or evening and or night. Because male sperms live longer and are stronger in the morning i didn't even know that i don't think in my encounters with reading the shuttles method method and things along the lines i didn't see anything about like early morning timing and stuff like that so i'm gonna definitely check that out but as of now um that was the aim i tried to do that but obviously i was a day off and now um it's just hard with baby, well, not with baby, the baby is fine, but it's hard honestly trying to not only TTC when, you know, you've got, it's not just you involved, your partner's involved and they may work and everyone gets tired and then we're trying to work out now morning schedule, when especially when my partner wakes up super early, as well as limiting ourselves to just two or three days of the month not even it's like two if if it's the day before ovulation ovulation and maybe the day after that's that's literally three days out of seven what that i could um maximize my chances so it, it's it's a little hard the going is a little bit tough but we're just going to try it out for this month or so and see how that works this is our first meth month and our first attempt at trying out the shuttles method and I definitely want to see what happens. So stay tuned if you're on the same journey with me and you want to see what's going to happen. Will it work? That will be very interesting. I have four girls already. Five, a boy. Number five. A boy. Wow. That would be strange. It would be very different. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. Hope you guys um are enjoying my little videos. If there's any particular videos that I want you guys want to see me do, definitely leave a comment down below. I also want to do what um your assumptions about me tag on this channel. So if you guys can um write your assumptions about me, I would love to do the assumptions, your assumptions video and answer those questions for you or confirm things 
so um yeah leave a comment down below and let me know ah there's a baby at my feet thanks for watching guys much love bye